Back in the early 90s, there was nothing better for an impressionable young lad than to watch a bunch of grown men in small panties running around hugging each other. As it was known then, the WWF was absolutely massive. So in 1991, the creators of Double Dragon, Technos, released WWF WrestleFest, a vastly superior sequel to their 1989 hit, WWF Superstars. The game featured many of the World Wrestling Federation's top superstars, with the ability to play as Hulk Hogan, The Ultimate Warrior, Mr. Perfect, and Noel Edmonds lookalike Ted DiBiase, as well as top tag teams such as the blatantly Kiss-inspired Demolition and the Legion of Doom. Featuring great graphics and a great cast of superstars, another huge attraction to the many wrestling fans was the trademark moves of the wrestlers themselves. You could pull off Hulk Hogan's leg drop, the Ultimate Warrior's splash, and Mr. Perfect's perfect plex. Nice! You can create your own tag team partnership in the Saturday Night's Main Event Mode, in which you attempt to take on your chosen partnership through several matches to reach Tag Team Champions, the Legion of Doom. Beat them, and you've got the belt! Another great thing about the game was that four players could all play at the same time, unlike the original's pitiful amount of only two players. You could team up against each other in a tag team matchup and gain advantage with some great double teaming action too. Who were misses? But where the game really came into its own was the Royal Rumble mode, one of the biggest events in the WWF calendar, which is every man for himself. You could defeat opponents by throwing them over the ropes, forcing them into a submission, or cuddling on top of them in a massive man pile. BUNDLE! Unfortunately, the game has become a bit of a jinx to the majority of the wrestlers involved, so let's take a few moments to think about them. Sadly, the game has never appeared outside of arcades, mainly as the claim had the rights of their own craptastic wrestling titles, which ironically has probably placed WrestleFest as one of the greatest wrestling games of all time. So if you see it at some skanky old urine-soaked seaside arcade, pop in a couple of 20p's. It's the most fun you'll have with large, sweaty men this side of Soho. Now go for the next match.